for, react, for reaction, let's get right to Republican North Dakota Senator John Hoven. Uh, here's the thing. Here's what we want to hear from you and know about, Senator. Were Democrats sure. who were sort of against the vote, you know, voting present, are they worried behind the scenes because the Green New Deal will slam the poor and the middle class with higher taxes and energy bills? I mean, Mitch McConnell is saying it's going to destroy industries and jobs. A lot of people are saying that. It's, it's very costly and unrealistic. It's really a socialistic type plan that goes way beyond. But are Democrats uh, worried about that? Is, are they concerned well, about that? Well, clearly they voted present, but I think if you look at it, there were four Democrats that voted with us, voted no. The other uh, 43, in essence, voting present, you'd have to almost look at, at that as a yes vote, uh, but they didn't want to actually vote yes. Um, so obviously they're concerned about it. You know, even President Obama warned Democrats at a closed door meeting yesterday, hey, the high price tag of your policies, that could hurt you at the polls. That's kind of rich given that he doubled down, uh, you know, he basically doubled the debt with things like stimulus and crash or, crash or clunkers. I mean, the Green New Deal has free everything, free health care, child care, tuition. The voters are going to say, hey, wait a second, how are you going to pay for it, right, Senator? Well, that said, as you mentioned earlier, it's $93 trillion. Our, our entire GDP is about 20 to 21 trillion. So you can see it's just unbelievably costly. You're talking about everyone having to reno renovate their homes with energy efficiency measures to the tune of $30,000. You're talking about much higher energy bills. Uh, and then supposedly you're going to get all this free stuff. Well, as you know, it's not free. You're paying for it, hence 93 trillion dollars. You know, the president will be going to Grand Rapids, Michigan for a Thursday rally. Uh, voters, is it your take that voters want kitchen table issues that, you know, they're yeah. done with politicians destroying each other's lives with scandals? I mean, they, but, but the, the, what's happening right now, Senator, the Democrats have all sorts of policies out there that they're talking about, about, you know, in the Green New Deal, ending airplanes, also ending all insurance plans and Medicare for all, and the Electoral College. This is where the debate should be about policies, right? I think voters are done with all the scandal talk, no? Liz, the kind of things you talk about all the time, the bread and butter issues, cutting taxes, cutting regulation, growing the economy, more jobs, better pay, uh, addressing the, the crisis at the border, law enforcement, supporting our military, reducing the cost of health care. Those are the things that people want to hear about. And energy policy where we develop more energy with good environmental stewardship, more dependably lower costs, the bread and butter issues, just like you said. Senator John Hoven, thank you so much. Really appreciate it, sir. Come back soon.